Wukumi Ibrahim and you are welcome back to my channel <laughs> so welcome back to another vlog I'm going to be taking you guys around like I do I hope you guys have been enjoying it anyways before we go right into the video I'm going to be sharing um a verse with you guys um just to encourage somebody who is going through anxiety out there who is going through depression or who is going through that hard time and needs a word from god the word is that it's from isaiah 26 verse 3 and it says you will keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because he trusts in you so god is going to keep you in perfect peace if your mind is stayed on him see don't put your mind on that situation don't don't let your mind be stayed on that challenge don't let your mind be fixed i know it's hard to turn your your mind away from it i know because it's real it's happening but just just try to distract i wouldn't say distract but turn your mind away from that situation turn your mind away from that thing and just fix your mind on god fix your mind on god this is the time the bible um there's a saying that when it's when it's hard to pray that is when you should pray harder you pray harder when it's hard to pray so this is the time for you to fix your mind on god because that is where you will draw peace from the bible says that you god will keep you in perfect peace god will give you peace of mind if you keep your mind stayed on him what i do personally is when i know that anxiety is attacking or i'm in a situation that is that is overwhelming what i do is i just replace all those negative emotions with the word of god i begin to remember the word the word that god has spoken to me the word that god has told me concerning concerning my life the word that god has given me i'll start remembering them and i'll start i'll start holding on to them i'll be like god i know this is what your word says and i'll hold on to it just keep your mind fixed on god keep your mind saturate your mind with the word of god you can even what i do sometimes is i watch i go on youtube i watch christian um preachers and i watch christian sermons i just once one is ending i'm playing another one once another one is ending up and if you know you don't have that luxury of time to do that you can just read the bible pray ask god to give you a word and then you just remember the word anytime the anxiety attacks you say no satan this is what god has told me keep your mind stayed on god and god will keep you in perfect peace you don't need to be anxious you don't need to be worried god can give you peace god jesus is the prince of peace and he can give you peace concerning that issue you don't need god can help you to not be anxious and when and, and the bible says because he trusts in you there's an there's there's this there's an importance of trusting in god faith is very very key don't let the enemy steal your faith don't let your, the enemy steal your hope because it is true faith that you conquer it is true faith we overcame we, we overcome true faith by faith the bible says the just shall live by faith so it's important that you trust in god that your faith is very important don't throw away your faith so the so you need when anxiety attacks all you need to do is just to keep your mind stayed on god i'm going to be showing you guys what i'm wearing i'm wearing a shirt that says think less and do more <laughs> so um anyways i'm going to take you guys along come along with me and enjoy the day with me <laughs> Guys, this is what I'm wearing. <laughs> it's just a regular top and trousers because I'm going shopping and I just want to take you guys along with me. This is what I'm wearing. This is what I look like. I'm wearing normal, regular trainers and yeah. <laughs> And I'm definitely going with this thing. It's it's huge, I know. It's so huge. It's like my I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm going with it. I don't I don't have the strength to be carrying so many nylon bags, um bags and all of that. So what I will do is I'll buy the stuff and keep them here. And I'll just all I'll need to do is just it has wheels, it has wheels, so I'll just need to wheel it and go. So yeah. yeah.
share something with you. The Bible says in Matthew chapter 11, verse 28, it says, Come on, I think it's Matthew 11, 28, but I'm not sure. It says, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. So if you're if you, if you're laboring and you're heavy laden, if you feel like you're carrying a weight and a load that is too much for you to bear, Jesus says, Come unto me, and I will give you rest. Jesus says, Come unto me. He is able to give you rest from your labor, from your from 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 the burden you've been carrying jesus is able to give you rest he just wants you to come to him just come to him jesus is able to give you rest no matter what you are going through jesus is able to give you rest i just wanted to share that word with somebody out there who might be feeling overwhelmed jesus is there for you just go to him just and it's easy it's as easy as saying jesus i am here please help me just say jesus help me that's as easy as that and jesus will surely help you so you guys i want to end the vlog here this is um this is me going shopping today i'm sure you saw me going shopping and i want to end the vlog here if you liked this video please ensure to give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more of me talk subscribe guys if, if you have not subscribed please subscribe what are you waiting for click the subscribe button down below and turn on your post notification um button just click on the post no the bell the post notification bell and you'll be notified when i put upload videos and Put your comments in the comment section below. If anything blessed you, if you're encouraged by anything, or if you liked anything, just let me know. Let's talk. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Till next time. Bye.